My name is Michael Martin. I'm the prop master on The Purge. I'm Ashley Clements. I'm the assistant prop master on The Purge. This space is our big truck that we always have with us on set. Over here, these are our character bins. Jane is definitely corporate. Jane's briefcase. She has a resume. Welcome aboard, Jane Barber. Thank you. You won't regret my hiring. Envelope of money. All my money's here? All of it. No contact from this point on. You'll get a text when it's done. Miguel is one of the main characters on The Purge. He comes equipped with the vest and a gun. We never keep any real weapons or even like the airsoft in their bins. Usually he'll have a rubber, you know, if we're not up close on it. And night vision goggles. Joe is a big combination of us and costumes because he wears like armor. He has this whole belt. So costumes just help create, you know, what the armor and the overall aesthetic looks like. And then we get to have the fun job of propping him up with weapons. My name is Lauren Bott. I'm the costume designer on The Purge. Jenna, does it look like a rental? No way. You look amazing. I like to read the script first just for story. Then I sort of read it again and, and pick out the moments that they've discussed, like, you know, a specific shirt or a specific dress. And then I take each character and I read the script thoroughly for that one character. So for Miguel, he's in one outfit the entire time that was just about pulling pieces of his history. It's pulling where he comes from, how he feels, what's his motive in the script. Then you have the cult, which we custom built all of the robes. We got to source the fabric and build for the younger guys and then the older guys. And then you have this huge, rich, really intense party. To me, it represented all the different layers of society. And getting to dress all of those sort of equally is nice. We have been having to pump out masks. Every single person has a different sort of whimsical and then also extremely creepy serial killer mask. On top of that, we did 50 fun party glittery masks. The challenge, I think, is pumping them out and having them maintain a level of creativity. We wear these masks to commemorate those who paved the way and purged before it was legal. Another two ounces of blood on his shirt. Copy that. So different types of blood for different situations. Like if you have it on the colors. Mouth, you know, you have to use a certain blood. There's flowing blood depending like if it's the cut, if they're, you know, there's drying blood, there's all different types. I think a lot of work's been put into it and I think it'll show on TV. Working with the showrunner, the production designer, the actors, everyone to help the character really come to life is really, really fun. Blessed be America, nation reborn. A future more prosperous.